Bill Marcus from Modern Spartan Systems, and our company is a chemical company. We make specialty chemistry. Our chemistry does four primary things better than anything we would compete against. Not trying to brag, but it's, it is what it is. So we can remove contaminants very, very well. We can pull things out of metal that other, other cleaners will not pull out. If you clean with another cleaner, then you use our carbon destroyer, which is this one here. And you let it sit two, three minutes, let the chemicals activate, you'll see more stuff come out of the metal because metal is porous and actually holds contaminants. So we're trying to surface prep for our lubrication system. Our lubrication system is different because the things that we do is we reduce friction by about 90% and we stop metal wear, pretty much flat line metal wear, and then contaminant re-adhesion. We very minimize uh, re-adhesion of contaminants. So when you clean the gun, everything top to bottom with this cleaner, if you need, if you've got copper and lead, you can use this product too. But then you apply the accuracy oil, and some people have guns where they like to use grease too. You can uh, apply the accuracy grease in those spots. But the accuracy oil, what it does, the chemistry changes the surface structure of metal, which differentiates it from anything else. What the chemistry is doing is it is filling it in, making it harder, smoother, and tighter, and locking up the surface uh, of the substrate. And that's how you reduce the friction. Typically, um, friction is reduced in an oil which puts a film down and creates a wedge between two pieces of metal. And the problem in guns is that the temperature and the pressure is too much and you actually cook it or carbonize and coke up the, the, the carbon in those greases and oils. And it adds to the carbon, but it's not, not doing anything for friction. Our stuff, when you change the sur sur surface of it, drops friction by about 90%, which is a magnitude different than anything we would compete against. And when you do that, certain things happen to the gun in performance. So the first thing is you would feel super smooth on the gun. Anything that's like a little gritty or tight, if you put this on there right away, even if you just um, Cerakote a gun, it takes a little while to break that in, almost immediately it feels super smooth. The next thing you would notice as you're doing the conditioning process is that you're taking more and more friction out of the barrel. And so as you do that, you shoot three rounds, uh, repatch the barrel, shoot three rounds, take uh, repatch the barrel, you do that five times. And as you're doing that, your shot groups get tighter and tighter and tighter. So you're maximizing the, the minimizing the amount of friction that's in that in that barrel. So <clears throat> when you do that, your accuracy improves uh, because it's like a dry lube. Your your um, reliability in different extreme temperatures, like super cold or hot or humid or blowy sand, things that would normally affect firearm performance. It just doesn't happen, so it's uh, reliability is almost 100%, which is important for everybody, but especially like law enforcement or military competition shooters. We get a lot of competition shooters that loves the product because they know that they can focus on their shooting and they don't have to worry about uh, the gun performance or any kind of malfunction issues. Um, other thing, it's a real big thing for most people is cleanup. When you clean uh, a gun, if it normally takes you an hour, once you've got our stuff onto the metal, all the contaminants, instead of having a place to bite into, they're sitting on the top. And so when they're on the top, it's easy to clean. So your cleanup time is typically about half of what it normally is. Sometimes it's like significantly faster than that, including on uh, uh, like black, black powder rifles, muzzle loaders. Those kind of guns where it's a lot of cleaning, a little bit of little little bit of shooting, that inverts to a lot of shooting and a little bit of cleaning. So 50 cals to many guns, to muzzle loaders, handguns, this stuff is like perfect. Um, also stops corrosion. Our stuff can be used to clean corrosion and remove it. Uh, barrel temperature, uh, barrel life, throat wear, all those things are improved. The best way to know if this product works besides using it yourself if you just wanted to see is to uh, go, go check out um, Google us on YouTube and look at some of the videos what we're doing at a Timken bearing machine and uh, we're taking our product against other products and we put the weight on the machine and it will instantly stop the, the, the turning on the on the rollers and with our stuff the same five gallon bucket of water it just keeps spinning and spinning and spinning so if you watch that bottom line is you'll know real quick what our product does compared to anything else. So I would say these are the best products on the market if you really want to optimize the performance of your guns. 
Um, we also have called Suppressor Shield Pre-Treat Kit, which I think is pretty much a one-of-a-kind type of product. If you use this and follow the instructions on here, for either new or used clean suppressors, um, it'll make them about 90% easier to clean up in the future. So compensators and suppressors, this is a way to, to uh, kind of optimize that and keep it functioning. So where do we find these products? Are they available, available in local stores or web? Uh, there are some dealers in different places, but we are looking for more dealers. And uh, right now, the primary place people get it is on our, our website, which is www.modernspartansystems.com. And if you go there, and there should be a link coming up uh, from you guys, then uh, an easy, easy way to get it. Order it. Great value. Cheapest thing you can do to make your gun function at a much higher level. <sighs> Kelly Briss, it's a very easy thing to do. You want me on a gentle businessman, light and where the light leads are. Share with you a few of the dogs. Hey guys, how are you doing?